Hello everyone and welcome back. Are you ready for another adventure? That's not the thing I say at the beginning. It's okay, I'm here with Zenron. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. <laughs> and we're here with some more Monster Crown. Some stuff is happening. We finally made it to town and let's continue the story. Because there's story here. Oh, hi there. Any advice for a guy hopelessly in love? Ha. No. No. <laughs> get out of love. Or get the girl. Either one. Or if you're already in love with the girl. Do better. Both. Do yeah, better do at better. getting the girl. Get good. Uh, when an exciting time. Kids, this will put Windy Promise on the map. Well, bigger on the map, at least. Okay. What do you have to say to me, Kung Fu Man? I hey, can't wait get to get to work. Those mines are going to make me some real cash. I'll finally make a name for myself. Doesn't even have a name right now. Oh boy, making all the food in town sells to those passing through going to Isaac Farm is a lot of hard work. We can't afford the best of equipment here, but we always make do, or we usually do. It seems everyone is buzzing around now that the prospectors are in town. Even the mayor has been acting strange. The new kings take some getting used to. They'll regularly stop by, speak with the leaders. Speak with the people, give advice, and generally seem to want everyone to be happy and have their needs met. Although maybe that's just our king, King Dania, and the east seems a lot colder to Mao in the west, it seems. To have a lot of health issues to keep himself a bit more. It's a multi-king uh, feudal system, I guess, in this place. Okay. Yeah. I don't know about that. Oh, Tamer, young Tamer. Come over here. Shh, kid. Come over here. Who's, who's talking to me? Ho, oh, I'm this town's healer. You look like a Tamer, but you've never heard of us? No worries, though, kid. Here's my Kiri. It's a special type of monster with some spe pretty amazing magical powers. The kings employ us to offer a healing service and give each of the Kiri for a private breeder. While they are unsuited for combat, they can unleash a wave of powerful healing over your monsters. Unfortunately, it uh, leaves her out cold for quite a while. I'd be happy to heal your monsters as would be my comrades, but to ensure only tamers that truly need it to take advantage of Kiri's abilities, use them, there is a cost. If that's okay by you, just give me the word and I'll get your team held up straight away. So it's not like Pokemon where the healthcare system is free. Here's fifteen dollars. Heal my wow. heal my monsters. Wow, capitalist healthcare in my monster catching game. Unbelievable. Never been seen before. Not like in Pokemon where it's a perfect ideal communist world. <laughs> Hi, Wookie. Do you recognize me? You probably don't. Your mom and I went to school together as kids. Of course I don't. Why would I? Yeah. Oh, you went to school with my parents? What was I supposed to osmos <laughs> that information in the womb? Yeah, when you were just a small egg. <laughs> Do you remember me from back then? No, I don't. Jasper! Everyone's so excited, but I'm not sure why. The only one that should be excited here is me. They think the prospector just came around out of nowhere. I'm going to own this town. Alright. I am just 14 years old. I don't know why you told me this. My daughter spends far too much time with her boyfriend. I'm starting to think they're codependent. This is truly the most scary thing ever. Codependency. Not Hello. codependency. You're one of the prospectors? No, you're not. You're too young. The town's in the midst of starting up a mining operation, so there's plenty of prospectors about. Pretty exciting. It is pretty exciting. I want to see if she has anything else to say. I don't remember if she does. No, okay, no. Only one thing. Okay, let's move on. Whee. What do you got to say, lady? Well, we all pay taxes to the kingdoms, and the kings regularly visit, offer advice. Towns are generally pretty self-run without much interference. With a great mayor, it's wonderful, but with one that can't stand up for himself, well... The entire system comes shutting down on itself. It all comes crashing down around us. Easily. Like a house of cards. Exactly. I don't trust that Jasper. He's got a silver tongue. He seems to be in a thrill for taking advantage. I don't think a silver tongue is what you think it is, because that man over there saying, I own this city, <laughs> loudly to a random time. Yeah, tongue. it's not really a silver tongue. He's just kind of an asshole. Yeah. Of others. All right, dude. Whatever you say. I don't trust him either, and I've only known him for two minutes. Mayor. Sorry, I'm not in the mood for talking today, but uh, please enjoy our local wares and our fabulous restaurants. All right. Terrible mayor. Check. It's a bunch of complicated looking books. They make packs seem simple in comparison. It's probably algebra books, if I were to take a guess. <laughs> yeah, Tenth somebody... grade geometry. <laughs> yes. Hard stuff, Zen. I could easily summon a demon. I could not as easily, um... Uh, 
learn math. It's tough. Oh, hello there, young boy. At times over the past 20 years, I would take a moment to look out to see. I could always see them watching those <laughs> monsters just beyond the shore. <laughs> that got the weird F fast. <laughs> you did. What, is, what, is, what are you going to show me? Oh, God. <laughs> what? They're just there? No hope lies beyond the shore. <laughs> That's what everyone says. It's only now at the end of my life that I ask myself. Is it really the Ephil that are watching? Sir, I'm 14. I don't know if you're having like a religious conscience or a religious breakdown. Oh. What a selfish man I must be. To have spent my life carefree and now burden you with troubling questions like these when you are so young. Enjoy your life, boy. It, it goes by so much quicker than you could even imagine. Okay. Just gonna ignore whatever he just told me. A guy was basically staring at the sea and had a midlife crisis of some sort and said, What was life truly about? <laughs> Who Not are really the... a midlife crisis when he's like 90. Fair enough. Alright, let me see. I think I can. There's something I have to do here with the mine and stuff. Let me see if I can remember. I need to find that guy again, I think. You? Hey, I recognize your Isaac's son. Haven't seen you in a couple of years. Hope everything's great at the farm. It's pretty good. Well, good enough for me to leave, I guess. Are you one of the prospectors? No, you're too young. Oh, no. This is the lady who was already pretty happy about the whole prospecting thing. This is also a sign of old America, where everyone was just happy about prospecting. Alright, let me see. Let me move on now. I think I'm good to just move forward and see what's going on. If I remember right, you actually can go into the cave and you do stuff- Ooh, what is this? Knotless. Ooh. Salty the Spout. The Salty Spout. <laughs> I don't know that I love that. Not a great uh, name, for sure. Alright, now which one of these- I'm just gonna go with Ambigu because we're the same type. Smother. Wow, he's strong! Quit! <laughs> He's level 9. <laughs> oh no. That's probably not a great sign. That did too much. Ambigu! Oh. Alright, we're gonna have to go with our new giant monster man. Whalerus time. Yeah, you got this, Whalerus. Hit him with that uh, fin slap. Alright. I think if we can do one more fin slap and then ask him if he wants to join us. Alright, join me. Alright! Easy peasy. I assume he's named after the Nautilus, the Captain Nemo ship from uh, the story. Alright, let me see if we can find our new dude here. There he is. Nautilus are robust sh shallow sea creatures. They are comfortable in the shallows and the beach alike. They will douse passerbys that get uh, that get too close and slimy. Brian to ward off foes and in dire situations retreat, and retreat into their armored shells. All right, he's our dude now. This salty spit shiner is now one of us. Lost tamer pack, sweet. Just gonna kidnap that from whoever dropped that. That's cool. No problem. No issues here. I have no ethical quandaries. Prospector. Whoa there, boy! We're doing some pretty sensitive work here. This equipment is fragile. Stay back in town now. I can't afford to lose time dealing with nosy folk like you. Apprentice. Bo boss, this place is absolutely loaded. We've got at least 20,000 G worth of mineral zephyr at the surface alone. Daniel, keep it down! We're trying to get a good deal on this contract. You're ruining our business deal, boy, by shouting it at this 14-year-old. <laughs> Don't go shouting <laughs> something like that. Sorry, boss. <laughs> Listen, kid, can you keep your mouth Child. shut? Child. Yeah. Last thing we need is for Jasper to know about this. Everyone's out for themselves in this business. We'll be working for less than a minimum wage if Jasper finds out how valuable this place really is. Here, take 100G and go grab whatever's loose in the cave floor. Just stay quiet and get back to town until we're done. I'll do that. Let me first look at this thing. 
Bleed! Ah, little devil. <laughs> we don't have one of these guys on the team. So we could definitely get him. It looks like some kind of evil billy goat. Uh, hmm. We go with Skull Slam. Wow, it dealt oh, a lot of cute. damage. He's cute. He's fucking cute. He's very adorable, but he's also fucking Belite. up. Bleat. Bleat. Oh, he's still oh, our asses, though. Absolutely destroying us. All right, it's time once again for Walrian. <laughs> Come Walrus. out, wa Walrus. Guy whose name is literally just Walrus. Yes. All right. I need you to not deal that much damage. Oh, wait. Actually. Yeah, drink some water. Yeah, yeah. That's good. All right. We can just drink some water for now and try and hope to God that we do not kill this this tiny adorable goat in one move. All right, fin slap. Oh no! Yikes! I got mean, I absolutely shit blasted. He absolutely got destroyed. Some monster playing outrank others in inherent power. You'd think general power levels would be a good indication of a monster's power, but a powerful monster at level 10 will still be a level 10 road ask easily. Let me tell you more about my power scaling and how it works. Oh yeah, hey, boy. can you like back off a road ask? Why you gotta do him like yeah, that? Yeah, don't do him like that. Don't do him like Yamcha. Oh boy, I just keep screwing up. I swear, it's my first year on the job. Well, let me through the goddamn Okay. Thing. Can you get out of the fucking way? Yeah. Let me see if I can talk to him first. I've got to keep reminding myself I was a newbie once as well. Can I please know inside the game? No, okay. Apparently not. Let me go back. Cause let me see. I don't think I can tell it to Jasper, but I'm going to assume he knows. Let me go quickly heal up too, because everyone's a little bit damaged at the moment. I already did the 15, so I don't think I have to pay again. There we go. Okay, thank god. I don't have to- I don't- I don't rat out to Jasper here, which is nice. Oh, here, this guy. The prospectors are nearly done? That's great. Jasper, what do you mean, Jasper? Why would that be dealing with- Oh, crap. Can you come with me? Alright. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. Jasper, listen, listen. you're under arrest. <laughs> listen, listen. It's all legal in black and white. You can't argue with the paperwork. You own the only store in town. You scalp and charge us ridiculous amounts of money. We can barely afford food for our kids. You want to own the mine too? What? Jasper is going to own the mine? Of course I'm going to own the mine, you damn peasants. What, you're all angry because you didn't think of it first? Because you lost a good deal when I was the one fast and smart enough to get in on it before you? That's just the law of nature, you cowards. Forward thinkers, entrepreneurs, go-getters, it's people like me who reap the rewards. The mayor was going to sign it. The deed was supposed to be ours, the king himself agreed. We should all own it. We should all reap the rewards of our own. We'd finally be on the map. We'd all be wealthy. Too bad! You were all too weak to reach out and take it, and it's mine now. <laughs> Hold it as money! <laughs> Don't you worry, I'll be sure to pay you at least a little something to work for me. You'll be able to aff you'll afford to feed your children. That's what you want, right? You, annoying noisy child! <laughs> You think having a monster makes you untouchable, don't you? Huh, I'm a forward thinker. Do you really think a man like me wouldn't be prepared for trouble like you? Now I have to beat communism into this man, Zen. As the enemy approaches. What is that? <laughs> oh my god, what the fuck? Uh, okay. Damn, I fuck. I don't know what this is. I'm, I'm gonna go with Laz and hope for the best. Oh, thank Scaven god. Gavin Geist. Oh, what the fuck? It turned into, like, some it, kind of weird... Oh, it, it, it swapped it out to Kreesa. To Kreesa, okay. Alright, then. Well, we need to swap out, then. Let's see. What is weakness of this one? I'm just gonna go wal with Walrus and hope for the best. Let's see. Fin slap. This should be it's enough. It's worked out so it. far. Oh, yeah! <laughs> oh, my God. This Walrus is extremely powerful. I wonder if I can just, like, fin slap you into oblivion. No, I can't, actually, because I'm dis disadvantaged. All right, time to go back to our boy, Laz. You got this, Laz. Scavenge Geist. Yeah, type advantage boost doesn't even need to really infect. 
I wonder what the percentage chance of infection is. 40%, okay. And now he's infected. We should be able to kill this guy, then. Yeah, get out of here. Fool. With your weird, evil-looking monsters. Even though, technically speaking, these all these monsters would be evil and bad. Just some are more eviler than others. Damn you, damn you, punk. Damn all of you, you're all beneath me, you're just bottom feeders grasping for crumbs. You'll never make it without me. You better run, Jasper. You better pray I don't catch you. <laughs> you think you can own us? You think you can starve our kids? David was right about you. What that kid did to your monsters, I'm gonna do to you. Well, I'm out of here. I like how it's turned into a crazy wild mob of murder. Jasper's son. Dad, wait! That's the kid in love. Mmm, yep. Yeah. Uh, there goes Jasper. <laughs> D Dad. <laughs> and he's gone now. <laughs> Problem solved. Uh, kid, well, this is a bit odd. Have you noticed your monsters aren't growing beyond the 10th level? Well, that's because you need to level up as a tamer to have your monsters respect you enough to grow as powerful. <laughs> oh, damn it, they won't go past level 10 because they don't respect me as a person, Zen. Oh, because they think you're a piece of shit. Exactly, as they can be. Each town has a chief tamer you can defeat to break the next level, uh, the next limit, but, well, ours was Jasper. <laughs> so while this isn't exactly the way things should be done, you just became a level 1 tamer. Your monsters will now grow freely to the 20th level. Additionally, as your monsters level up and face new challenges, you'll gain respect points. Those points come in handy later in your career as a tamer, trust me. Be sure to, take the, uh, be sure to seek the chief in the crossroads town if you want to grow further. I've gained one respect. Thank you for the respect. Okay, let me see if I can go in here. No, nothing here that I can see for respecting me anyway. I think if I go in here... With... Oh, shit. Let's go talk to that kid, because he just watched his dad die right in front of him. I'm sure he has some stuff to talk about. How am I supposed to just go back to normal? <laughs> I watched my father die! <laughs> Who's gonna take care of me yeah, now? Yeah, that's not... All I know is I need to be with Kelly. God, Dad, why'd you have to be so... Yeah. Your dad was kind of a dick. So that kind of sucks for you. Uh, let's go talk to his girl and see if his girl will be, like, better about him. Jack. Oh, is he okay? Oh, thank God. Mom and Dad won't let me see him. Could you please tell him that as, as soon as I can get out of here, I will be there for him? I can't imagine what it's like to lose a father like that. I know the villagers will be making snide remarks. <laughs> I'm talking shit on him. He's like, damn, what an idiot. <laughs> Did you see how he went out? <laughs> went on a boat, stupid moron. Oh, wow. I had no idea. She really loves me back that much. I can't believe that won't let us be together. Good guy, I really am. I I'm a good guy, I really am, I swear. It's just my dad who's kind of a dick. Please tell her I believe we'll be together in the end. Alright, you got it, buddy. We're we're here to make a love connection, then. This guy lost his dad, we can't make him lose his girl at the same time. Hey look, it's that guy! Oh, trust us, we know exactly who he is. He's that monster's son. What does it matter who his son is? It, hang on. Is it really acceptable to use monster as a derogatory term in a world where everyone's best little buddies are called monsters? Hmm. You know what? That is a politically correct statement that I think would be further explored. Maybe this is what they're saying. Who are the true monsters here, Zen? The little monster <laughs> in my pocket who's a giant walrus? Or this fucking asshole who won't let his daughter date a, <laughs> date a boy? Uh. Uh, you're acting like he can't be his own uh, person. Be someone completely different. Someone that loves me. Kelly, lower your voice. How dare you talk to your father with that tone. Kel, I forbid you. I forbid you from ever seeing that boy again. It's a matter of time before he grows up and decides to find a way to succeed where his father, Jasper, failed. <gasps> I can't believe. You'll never understand me or Jack. We're going to be together no matter what it takes, and if this backwards... Town is going to hold the sins of his father against him. We'll just have to go far away from here. 
Don't worry, Clarice, she's just an angry teenager. Give her a few hours to blow off some steam. I don't know, Pierre. I think she's willing to risk anything to be with him. It's young love. They're raging with hormones. They don't have any Jesus Christ! <laughs> yeah, this guy's kind of a dick. They don't know what love is something worth throwing away your future for. We never had to throw our futures away to be together. Exactly! We found each other, we decided to make it work. We put in the work, we built love. Would you... Would you have thrown away everything for me? That's the point, we didn't have to throw away anything to be together. <laughs> we, <laughs> we were mature. But would you have? So what, you're on her side now? You both read too many books, your head's in the oh, clouds. Oh no! Love isn't about running off together in the heat of the moment, it's about dedication. It's about building a life together after you found someone with the same goals. I think love is about devotion. Maybe being willing to risk it all is uh, risk it all is the only love that means anything. When you've gotten your head out of the clouds, Cl Clarice, and you're ready to act like a mother and set your daughter straight, let me know. Damn, you suck. Yeah, don't say anything. What do you gotta say? Uh, <laughs> no, she's still afraid that her daughter is codependent. <laughs> she still is on that. He doesn't have anything to say to me though. I think if we go up here, let's see. Oh, where did they go? They're gone forever. Man, Jasper didn't deserve to die. He deserved to be beaten black and blue and learn a lesson, but well. He should have known what he was getting into rowing out to sea. Everyone Jesus. knows that if you do that, you're going to end up dead. Just makes sense. Hey, guys. Isn't that the thing that killed your dad? Oh, there he is. Hey, it's Loki. You probably think we're dumb running off, right? I know it's crazy, but just being able to speak our minds freely to someone like you let us figure what's really important in life. Don't worry, we aren't heading out to sea, just somewhere on the island far from this small backwards town that doesn't know a thing about what's really important in life. I found this gem near Dew Cave when I was little. It's uh, totally empty looking, but my grandmother told me it was a special type of gem called a subtractor. Help me realize that we've had enough, it's time to find true happiness. You need to subtract everything what you love most. I hope it helps you find happiness, too. Got Subtractor. Wish us luck in our new life. Bye. I'm glad me, this 14-year-old boy, was, help you, was able to help you move on with your life. And now those I other, did it. I did it. I can't wait to call Dad and tell him what you did. So I watched a man die today, Dad, and then I helped their, <laughs> their parents elope. Oh, really? Well, uh, thank God you weren't the one in the water. All right, son. <laughs> I'll talk to you later. <laughs> I'll see you uh, sometime later. Hope you stay safe. All right, let's heal up. I think that's all we need to do in this town. And that's about as far as I went, because after that dude got murked, I said, I should show Zen this at some point. <laughs> Perfect. What like, is that big old fucking dude with a house on his back? Yes. It's the domesticated monster of Burden Labin. At ease, Labin. I guess this thing just lives to forever be in servitude. It's just an it's just like a, an ox. Yeah. I'll save up right here. Maybe we'll continue this at some point. I don't at this point I have no idea what's gonna happen. So anything could happen. <laughs> but I kinda yeah, like this is like there's a lot of shit happening. Yeah, this game is cool. And it, I think it was only made by one person. And there's also some other later stuff, like... I think there might be... Few, like I said at the beginning, I'm pretty sure there's like a thousand monsters in this game. Just filled to the brim with monsters. So we'll see where... If we return later, how that goes. But that's it for now. Look at our stout team here, though. Laz. Stacked. Primagon. And Bigu. See, I, we need to see what Ambigu involves into as well. Yes, Ambigu is going to be wild. Yeah, Secret, Rodask, Walrus. I, his name really is just Walrus. Yeah, it is. Just straight up. And Secret's Walrus. name is literally just Secret. Yeah, Secrete. Oh, I get it. <laughs> like, like, you're secreting. But also you have a secret. <laughs> a Great. secret secretion. And not less. He just joined the team, though. All right. Till next time, everyone. You guys have a good day. We'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. Goodbye, everybody. Bye-bye.